What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? So we're here today with Hunter X Hunter Rap by Frank Tomboy Fit featuring um, a Dizzy Eight. Now I'm pretty sure I've heard the name Dizzy Eight before, but I'm not exactly sure where. Um, this one is titled "License to Kill." So, I mean, just by that first frame, you can tell it's about killer. It's about killer, um, or maybe it's about the whole, the whole uh, Zoldic family. I'm actually not sure, but Hunter X Hunter. Let's talk a little bit about it first. Um, I think everyone likes Hunter x Hunter, to be completely honest. I think everyone that has watched it or have read it likes it to some degree. So do I. I d I'm not one of those people that hold it like to the highest degree like other people do. But I still hold it to a very high degree. Um, I probably like, if I had to like, t you know, give it a tier ranking, I'd give it an A. That's kind of where I would put it. Hunter x Hunter is just a good show. It's a, just a good manga, just a good anime. It's just good vibes until it's not good vibes and then it's terrible vibes until it's good vibes again so that's kind of that's kind of nature of hunter x hunter um but besides that as i always say please go ahead and check out the original video which i'll have linked in the description down below and besides that though let's hop right in and see what this one has in store for us today let's get started let's get started is that loud enough i'm not sure should be fine. Toby. Toby. Bring that heat, boy. License. Uh, what is your deal? No Jack Hollow, but I wanna know what's popping for real. Okay. Is the body moving fishy? He'll come up with a real. They ain't know we highly lethal. Got that license to kill. Kill. Uh, okay. What is your deal? No Jack uh. Hollow, but I wanna know what's popping for real. Okay. If somebody moving fishy, hook him up with a real. They ain't know we highly lethal. Got License to kill. Uh, pull up just to upset the balance. Yeah, we don't go steady. Oh, that's the movie. That's um, I've not even seen a movie. Or is that an OVA? I'm not sure. I don't. I don't recognize that scene at all. That license to kill. At all. Uh, pull up just to upset the balance. Yeah, we don't go steady. Haters thought they jump in the crew, but we were already ready. Say he okay. pulls cheese, but there ain't no tension. He don't stress me. Nothing like the hunter exam. So how he go? He gon' test. Me. Okay. Put him down to size with the cloak. Usually it gets my morals, but they want in the smoke. But I bet when my goof a lot. I like that. First of all, the cape, obviously, the uh, Phantom True bag, and then you go with the smoke, obviously, with moral. Usually it gets my morals, but they want in the, the smoke. smoke. But I bet when my goof pull up, then he bound to choke. I'm going to land up with the straps, leave a man full of holes. Feel like killer with the kidnapping and the sass and the bird. There's a price up on your head, you best not ask what it's worth. Get through again for you, okay. All ain't no surprise that I ate. And you yell, y'all ain't got the text, so just tell it straight. Crazy slots, I'm hitting different when I pull up. Okay, okay. Ooh. What is your I like that. I like that. Hey, and you yeah, y'all ain't got the got text, text so just, just tell it straight. straight. Crazy hey, slots, I'm hitting a different one. I'm pull up with eight. eight. Okay. Mm. Um. What is your deal? No Jack Harlow, but I wanna know what's, what's popping for real. real. If somebody moving fishy, he'll come up with a real. They ain't know we highly lethal. Got that license to kill. Ah. Uh. What is your deal? No Jack Harlow, but I wanna know what's popping for real. If somebody moving fishy, hook him up with the real. Well, the clean prince of Gotham himself. Wrong joke. What is your deal? What is your deal? Forget how you feel. Forget how you feel. Listen, you never was real. Never was look. I'm out in the field. Yo. Listen, I carry that still on me. Okay. Yes, they really wanna still on me. Claim they hate, but they still on me. See potential, wanna kill on me. Look, ah. you boys are unfamiliar. Me and Britain really running things, but I'm feeling like going and killing you. You don't really wanna battle. If I shoot, I promise you going up killing you. Oh. Listen, my skill is one in a million. I don't have fear. I'm not a civilian. I keep it real. That's funny, y'all feeling them. Oh. Okay. 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 All right. You don't really want to battle if I shoot, I promise you going up killing you. I like how this I like how like the beat for this one is like very very slow. Like like very very slow, like super slow. Uh which I actually kinda like considering I've been listening to a lot of things recently that have been like super fast paced. But this one is like very very slow, deliberately slow. One in a million. I don't have fear, I'm not a civilian. I keep it real, that's funny, you're feeling them. Oh, hey, yo. Listen, I'm born an assassin. All of my past is tragic. 
guess it's what made me a savage. I carry that blood in my package. True. I could have been dead in the casket. True. Instead, I rose from the ashes. Yeah. I broke up that trash I was trapped in. Uh, yeah. Look. Warfare, I was bred for it. I take out a target, make sure I get my bread for it. Yeah. See the scars, boy, I bled for it. <laughs> Coming from my head, you end up dead for it. Uh, what is your deal? No. I like that. Assassin, I was bred for it. Look, dope line. Warfare, dope line. I was bred for it. I take out a target, make sure I get, I get my, my bread, bread for it. it. Coming yeah. from my head. See the scars, boy, I bled for it. <laughs> Coming from my head, you end up dead for it. Uh, what is your deal? No Jack Hollow, but I wanna know what's popping for real. real. If somebody moving fishy, he'll come up with a real. They ain't know we highly lethal, got that license to kill. Uh what is your deal? No Jack Hollow, but I wanna know what's popping for real. If somebody uh, moving fishy, I like how this one is so delivered. So deliberately really slow. Lethal, got that license to kill. Uh. Yeah, but first thought, first immediate thought. I like it. I, I I know it's an easy thing to say. I like it, but like I genuinely like it. Um. There's a lot of things that have been like that I've been listening to. So I guess you know, from my perspective, there's a lot of things that I've recently been listening to that have been very, very fast-paced, um, beat-wise as well as the rhyming. Um, this one was slow, and it was deliberately slow. It was like to emphasize each word, so like let it speak for itself. You know, it sounds kind of stupid. Let let's let let it breathe. Let it, you know, see it, say what you want to say, and then let it breathe. Let, so you have to soak it in. That's kind of how it felt like listening to this one. Obviously, I'm a fast speaker. Yes, you can probably tell I'm speaking nonstop. Like I'm do 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 do. But like, you know, that's because I don't really emphasize my words. I just say what what's on my mind without thinking. But like, when like you really want to emphasize your words, you kind of slow it down. You're like, okay, listen. This was pretty fuego. And that's, that's really what it was. That's really what it boils down to. Uh, this was pretty fuego. Um, I've never, I don't think I've heard Dizzy Eight, you know, on a song before. But I'm pretty sure I've heard that name before. I'm not sure where though. Um, but he came with the heat as well. You know, both of them came with the heat, the fire, the flames, the ignition, the spark to ignite it all. Um, kind of, kind of interesting. Kind of interesting. Obviously, with the theme, I thought like it's gonna definitely be a lot more Killua themed, and while they both had Killua bars, um, it was very much just a Hunter x Hunter, like a diverse Hunter x Hunter uh, rap, which I actually kind of kind of like. So I, I'm not sure whether you know whether Hunter x Hunter is a I would, I would assume so that it's a popular series to rap about, and I'm, I'm not in the know, as you all know, <laughs> but. Yeah, I definitely want to check out some more Hunter x Hunter raps, and this I think is a great way to start with this one because this one was all about all the characters, not just specific characters. Now I think I did the Hisoka one a long time ago, but um, this one was about all the characters, which I actually very much like, very much appreciate, and I actually, it's a very underrated thing, I know, but, but like personally, I really like how it's slow. That's that's really it. I really like how it's slow because it's easy. To kind of hide and mask, yeah, hide and mask um, your words, your lyrics when you're going fast. Like you can not say anything and just be fast, and you know it will sound good. But when you're slowing it down, you have to actually you know say things. You actually have to say things and emphasize things. Um, either on a technical level, you know, it's sounding, you know, it, it being very impressive, or on a um, just a, a good sounding what would be a good audible level i guess you're going to call it that like a good sounding in a manner where it sounds very good um and what actually makes you think and pause and that's kind of what i got from this one it's a very deliberate style from both of them dizzy eight i think was a little bit you know a little a little bit more gung-ho i guess if you want to call it that gung-ho but that's because i'm not familiar with him at all whereas with uh breton boy i am more familiar with and i could def i could definitely tell that he was being a lot slower and more deliberate with this one whereas dizzy eight i feel like he was doing his thing he, he basically didn't you know he basically didn't go into this with like the attitude of okay i'm gonna have to stick to a theme i'm gonna have to um stick to a style 
I think that's probably the best way to do it. It's the best way to use a style where he's like, okay, I'm gonna have to like come with like the dopest metaphors, the dopest similes, um, whatnot. But he was just like, I'm gonna do me. I'm gonna say what I wanna say. Uh, and that's, that's gonna be that. And I think that works really, really well when you're when you have the opportunity to do so, when you have the opportunity to do so, when you have the opportunity to slow it all down, when you have the opportunity to say what you want to say in peace and have that message come across, I think it's very good to not come with like, okay, I need to be different, but more so I just need to kind of do what I want to do, like come with a mission and succeed in that mission. And that's kind of what I like about this one, that they both just came deliberately and they both just set their peace and they were like, you know what? I said my piece. I know we're not talking about one piece here. Peace, heh. Heh heh. Doom. But yeah, Hunter x Hunter. Or oh, Hunter, Hunter, no Hunter. Or Hunter squared Hunter. Or Hunter times Hunter. <sighs> That's my response to that. That's my response. Just a big, deep sigh. <sighs> Besides that, ladies and gentlemen, let me know what you all... Let me know what you all think. I think my fan is just about to break now as well. Awesome. Um, but I will see all of you in the next one, everyone. Until then, have a nice day. Peace out. And as always, bye. 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 See you later.